minus x squared that is equal to 0 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 and the answer is given in the C C is 0 so our answer is C right uh, this is the solution of uh, ninth question this is uh, from the differentiation side this is the third questions third question from differentiation side so this is the solution of ninth now the example number 10 uh, is also from differentiation and the question is d by dx uh, sorry d by dx of x raised to x is equal to blank so here uh, we need to differentiate x raised to x with respect to x so let us first take uh, let y is equal to x raised to x and we need to find dy by dx because y is equal to x raised to x we have taken so first take log both sides so log y is equal to log x raised to x okay so log y is equal to x log x we know that uh, log x raised to y is equal to y log x this is the property of uh, log functions so here log x raised to x is equal to x log x now if we uh, differentiate both side with respect to x so we will get the differentiation of differentiating both sides with respect to x so we will get the differentiation of log y that is 1 upon y into dy by dx and here uh, there is a x into log x if we want to differentiate this function with respect to x then we need to use the multiplication rule here so first कोई पन बे फंक्शन नो गुणाकार होई x ना अने जो एनो आपड़े विकलन करू होई तो आपड़े गुणाकार ना नियम नो उप्योग करसू एटले के एक फंक्शन नेम नम राखसू अने बीजा फंक्शन नो विकलन करसू प्लस बीजा फंक्शन नेम नो राखी अने पहला फंक्शन नो आपड़े विकलन करसू एटले के x d by dx of log x plus log x d by dx of x this is the rule of multiplication so uh, x uh, differentiation of log x that is equal to 1 by x plus log x because the differentiation of x that is equal to 1 so uh, only log x uh, this x and x is cancel so after all we get we will get 1 upon y into dy by dx is equal to 1 plus log x okay because 1 upon x into x that is equal to 1 and this is a log x so implies dy by dx that is equal to y into 1 plus log x and we know that uh, y is equal to x raised to x so d by dx of x s to x is equal to x s to x into 1 plus log x this is our answer x s to x into log x and the answer is given in the option c so after all our answer is c ok so this is the solution of uh, number 10th blank ok so now let us quickly move to the blank number 11 so note that there are four questions from differentiation side now we are going to solve the blank number 11 so 11th question is uh, from the integration side so integrate 10 square x with respect to x <coughs> right this is the simple question of integration we know that we can't integrate 10 square x directly with respect to x because 
we have not any formula for twin square x. So, first we know that uh, we will use some trigonometric relationships. So, we know that 1 plus tan square x that is equal to sec square x. So, tan square x is equal to sec square x minus 1. So, now integration of tan square x into dx that is equal to we can replace tan square x by sec square x minus 1. So, we will get sec square x minus 1 into dx. Okay? So, this is equal to integration of sec square x into dx minus integration 1 dx. So, now we have formula of sec square x. We know that integration of sec square x that is equal to 10 x okay, and integration of 1 is equal to x with respect to x. So, our answer is 10 x minus x and plus c and this answer is given in the option number uh, in the option number b. So, our answer is b this is the answer given in the b. So, our answer is b this is the solution of 11th blank. Okay? So, now let us solve the 12th blank uh, which is also from the integration side. So, uh, 12th blank. So, that is question is from the integration definite integration integration over 0 to 1 4 upon 1 plus x square dx this is the very simple question of the finite integration is equal to blank so here uh, this one is equal to 4 is the constant so uh, take it outside and your charge a constant shell up in a bar lay less and integration of say 0 to 1, 1 upon 1 plus x square. And after you have to say that 1 upon 1 plus x square no integration is 10 inverse x. So, uh, integration no formula is equal to 4 upon 1 plus x square no integration is 10 inverse x. And any limit is 0 from 1. So, this is equal to 4. So, the upper limit is x. So, the answer is 10 inverse 1 minus 10 inverse. The upper limit is default minus sign. And the lower limit x is 0. So, 10 inverse 0. Now, we have to say that 10 inverse 1 is 10 pi by 4 ni value 1. Thase, 10 inverse 1 that is equal to pi by 4 and 10 0 is equal to 0. So, 10 inverse 0 is equal to 0. So, this is the pi by 4 minus 0. So, that is equal to 4 into pi by 4 and the answer will be pi. Okay? And the pi answer is given in option number A. So, our answer is answer is a okay uh, this is again from the integration side so we have already solved two questions from integration side first one is from the indefinite integral and the second is from definite integration so now let us solve the uh, blank number 13 so the uh, blank number 13 uh, is from the differential equation so, the question is uh, the order of the order of the differential equation the order of the differential equation x into d square y by dx square minus 5 into dy by dx whole cube minus 2y is equal to 14 is blank. 
here we want to find the order of this, this differential equation x into d 2 y by d x square minus 5 d y by d x whole cube minus 2 y is equal to 14. We know that order of the differential equation is the order of highest derivatives occur in the differential equation. Like a differential equation no order like a differential equation in the j mota ma motu derivative was a in a apply differential equation no order case to a differential equation in there a second order differential che a first order differential che to highest order differentiation no kyo ta se eta se 2 to apply case su the order of this differential equation is 2 so order of order is equal to 2 so a differential equation order tha se 2 highest order differential which occurs in the differential equation is known as order of the differential equation so uh, order of this differential equation is 2 because here is the second derivative ok so order is equal to 2 and so the answer is b here b is 2 so answer is b right in the same way the 14th blank is also from the differential equation uh, which is uh, the question of that the degree of the differential equation degree of the differential equation x square into dy by dx plus sine d 2 y by d x square is equal to 0 is right here we want to find the degree of this differential equation by definition the degree of a differential equation is the degree of highest order derivative the highest order derivative is the order of differential equation and degree of highest order derivative that is the degree of the differential equation if we can show the differential equation as a polynomial of differentiation. Like a jare apre, jo apre differential equation ne differentiation na bahupadi sorupe dar savi sakta hoi. To any under je highest order derivative hoi, any je degree hoi in a differential equation ne degree kyoi. Pan a je differential equation che, any apre differentials na bahupadi sorupe dar savi shakki tem nati. Like we cannot show this differential equation as the polynomial of differentials. So, the degree of this kind of differential equation is undefined. So, we cannot find the degree of this differential equation. So, we can say that not defined. The degree of this differential equation is not defined. And the, so, the answer is D. In D, there is not defined. So, answer of this differential equation is D. So, this is the 14th question uh, which is also from the differential equation. So, if I remind you that there is a 14 question of multiple choice from A, B, C, D and we have already solved all the 14 questions and if you know that in this 14th quest, 14 question, we have already uh, 3 questions, 3 blanks from complex sides, ok, uh, 1 blank from functions, ok, then the 5th and 6th, uh, 2 blanks. Two blanks from a limit side, and then one, two, three, and four blanks from differentiation. Okay, and then two blanks from integration. And two blanks from the differential equation. 
okay so 4 plus 2 6 10 and the total blanks are 14 so uh, this is the just I want to uh, remind you that in this way there are blanks 3 from complex 1 from function 2 from limit so there is again total 3 from the functions and limit chapter 3 from complex number this is 3 and this 3 from this chapter again 4 blanks from differentiation side 2 blanks from integration and 2 from differential equation right so this is the idea of the <coughs> how they are going to ask the blanks in the 14th question ok so this is so just the idea of uh, blanks blanks ok so jare pan tamme pariksha deva jau to tamne magaj ma idea hovo joi ke around 3 blanks che a complex ma thi ase 4 blanks che differentiation ma thi ase around 3 blanks che functional limit ma thi ase 2 blanks che integration ane around 2 blanks che differential equation ma thi ase to jare tamme pariksha ni taiyari karta ho તમારે મગજમાં પૂરે પૂરો પ્લાનિંગ હોવો જોઈએ કે કયા ચેપ્ટર નું વેટેજ બ્લેન્ક્સ ની અંદર કેટલું છે તો એને અનુસરીને તમે તમારી एग्जाम ની પ્રિપરેશન કરી શકો તો આ તો ક્વેશ્ચન નંબર 1 કે જેમાંથી 14 માર્ક્સ નું આપણે સોલ્યુશન કરેલું તો હવે આપણે ઝડપથી ક્વેશ્ચન નંબર 2 ઉપર જઈશું તો ક્વેશ્ચન નંબર 2 છે ઓકે ક્વેશ્ચન નંબર 2 માં ક્વેશ્ચન છે એટેમ્પ્ટ એની which is from a question to a that is attempt any two and the marks six so each question is from of three marks so and the first question is simplify cos 2 theta plus i sin 2 theta raised to minus 3 into cos 3 theta minus i sin 3 theta raised to 2 upon cos 2 theta minus i sin